Rodgers. What do you think? I think he's a heck of a football player. Um, I think he's calm. He's in control. He's got a tremendous arm, uh, very accurate. Um, appears to be very smart, you know, with what he's doing. He's running the show. He's uh, setting the protections. Um, uh, you know, he, he understands matchups, knows what he's doing with it. He's a heck of a football player. I mean, there, there aren't too many better than him out there. He's done a good job of harassing quarterbacks, maybe not getting the sack, but making them uncomfortable move around. He's pretty experienced at that. And <laughs> plus, he's a run threat. So does that change how you approach this? We've dealt with guys that, that uh, can extend plays before. Um, you know, I always say there's two, two camps of guys. There's the guys that are going to uh, get out and scramble. You know, when they get out of the pocket, they're, they're gone, and you gotta, you got to find them. And then there's the guys that are going to um, scramble to buy time to throw. And to me, that's where they're at their most dangerous offensively is when he's extending plays. Because I think their receivers do a really good job in the scramble rules. Um, I think he's very accurate throwing on the move. And so if you broke down, I don't know the numbers off the top of my head, but if you broke down where their explosive plays are coming from, it's because of his ability to extend plays. And, and uh, uh, that's how they've made their, their hay for a long time. Can you take anything from how you guys prepared for Noah Fafita in Arizona a few weeks ago? Are they two completely different? A little different. You know, one of the things we, we gauge is, is kind of um, <clears throat> uh, the average depth of the drop back. And, and sometimes Noah Fafita was the kind of a guy that would throw a ball from 16 yards and, and just drift and drift and drift and made it hard to get there. And um, Whereas Shadur, I, I feel like, is a guy that's going to more step up, slide out, move around. He's a little more diverse in, in what his uh, stuff is. And, and no offense to Fafita, but he, he was a shorter guy. He probably needed to do it that way. And, and whereas Shadur is a, a bigger body that can, can step up and probably hurt you in more ways in the pocket. play both ways and he's been really good at wide receiver this year what have you seen from him well, I was hoping he was just going to play corner I don't, I don't know <laughs> um yeah he's he's uh the number one thing that jumps out to me uh with him is his ball skills are elite I mean he's got just incredible ball skills if there's a 50 50 ball he's got a, a better than 50 percent chance of getting it I'll say that and um you know uh, the other thing is he plays really hard you know a guy that plays as many snaps as he does you wouldn't think uh, that he would go as hard as he does all the time but he does he's got uh uh, he plays hard. He, he's a competitive guy and, um, you know, really, really competitive when the ball's in, in his vicinity. Focused on McMillan from Arizona. And they had other good receivers, but Colorado's got some serious weapons beyond Yeah, Yeah, it's, 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 it's not a one-trick pony, you know, it, they're a one-pony show, I should say. It's a, it, they got, they got, uh, um, they got a whole crew of them that, that can hurt you. Uh, you know, I, um, I'd say there's four, right? you know, guys that, that come to my head that all have their own set of skills that, that are unique and, and, and make them dangerous. So it's, it's a little more difficult, you bet, to, to, to do things and, and you know, uh, move your coverages around people um, so it, it, or positions. So he's, um, yeah, that, this is a good skill group for sure. Another offensive coordinator comes from the NFL. He was an NFL offensive coordinator for a long time. Do you see sort of NFL – tendencies or schemes that he sort of brought over from his time in the NFL. I do, yeah. When you look at Colorado a year ago um, and what they were doing offensively, you know, they tried to manufacture a lot of things with tempo. They tried to manufacture uh, some things with formations. They tried to uh, – that was their MO. And, and since he's been the guy, you can clearly see that it's more about matchups. It's more about uh, – there's, there's less formations. There's less, you know – and they're just trying to manufacture ways to get matchups. And that's, um, to me, that's NFL football. And that's, that's uh, absolutely, I can see that in what they do. Kleiman said he was hopeful to have Uso back because he had a good week of practice. He, uh, yeah, he has. He's been running around uh, uh, quite a bit the last couple of days. I would expect that he'll be, he'll be able to go. How this defense line operates. He's he's huge. Down. Yeah, he's huge in a game like this. You know, uh, Asher Tomaszewski's had a good week of practice. Um, uh, Malcolm Elkhorn Crowder's been up and, and, and he's improved this week. Um, but uh, you know, the thing that Uso gives us from that spot, and, and Damian does a great job too. But you know, Uso's such a, a twitchy pass rusher, and in a game like this, that the ball is going to be in the air more than it's not. Um, you know, he's a, he's a guy that we'd love to have. And so having him back's a, a big piece. You mentioned the ball 
interesting year and you know for a team that doesn't run the ball as much uh, how important is this to still try and take away the running game yeah and that's I, I think they've been a little bit more committed to it uh, the last couple of weeks and it's funny because when you when you watch how defenses kind of tried to attack these guys um, that was getting and, and probably that this is the reason is is they would start just getting to some exotic things um, you know when you watch the Nebraska game and stuff it, it didn't even look like base down defense out there and and so I think that's probably when they recommitted to the run a little bit and um, and uh, um, they ran the ball effectively I thought against Central Florida um, they ran the ball effectively at times uh, against Nebraska because of those fronts and things probably and so um, yeah, they, they, they're, that, it's not just a total chuck it all over fest. I mean, they're playing football.